Hi and welcome to your Gold Market Update and Charts of Interest for today, the 26th of January 2023 and happy Australia today for all of our clients based in Australia. My experience senior analyst here at Gold Markets to lead you around what's happening in a slightly quieter day in Asia today, but nevertheless lots going on. Overnight in the US we saw all major indices pair early losses and as it was down around about 1.8% in early trading and this and all the other indices made their way back to near neutral by the end of the session. We also saw some interesting after the bell action with Tesla reporting earnings and we're seeing them up about 4% in after hours trading. US futures as a result of that are mildly positive in early Asian trading. Mostly we see in Asian indices close with the ASX and the Chinese markets closed today. Uh, European equity futures pointing to a higher open this afternoon and the VIX is still trading around that key 20 level. The US dollar index remains under significant pressure and we've seen it drop again yesterday and falling again in Asian trading today, really failing to hold on to a support that had been bouncing along for most of the week so far. As a result, we saw gold move higher again and it's closing in on 1950 and 2000 looks very much on the cards going forward. Copper pauses below 430 still. It's been there all week really and all continue just to pull back a little bit after the strength we had earlier in the week. Bitcoin also pulled back from five month highs after that early week surge, but still at very high levels compared to where it's been over recent weeks. Earnings season obviously continues this week. We've got Comcast, Southwest Airlines, American Airlines, JetBlue and Intel all reporting the latter coming after the bell. And on the data front, we've got quite a big night in the US. We've got US weekly jobs, PCE and the GDP numbers. This is a preliminary number, so it's one that impacts on markets most. And so we may get some significant movement overnight. Let's have a look at a couple of charts of Color RI today. Very much worth having a look at gold and we'll put it on a weekly chart here. You can see there we are near this 1950 level. The next real resistance is around about this 1975 and then we're up to 2000 after that. If we pop it on a daily chart, you can see there that really this has been on a tear to the upside since the beginning of December. And again, we had that strong session last night closing near its highs and we get some follow through in Asia today. So the gold bulls are out. 1950 is a bit of a round number, so it may get stuck around there. But if it does breach that, then certainly that 1975 looks very much on. Uh, on the FX front, uh, again, we're looking at a weekly chart just to give context. And you can see here the Aussie US is underneath that 200 MA on the weekly chart. But really, this is a key level around about this 71.30 and looks as though this surge in the Aussie dollar versus the USD is going to continue. This was helped yesterday by those higher than expected CPI numbers. If we look at a daily chart, you can see this continued push throughout the week. And if we just check on the 30 minute chart, we had a high yesterday of around this 71.20 level. So a breach of that would suggest we are going up again. So that's one to watch throughout the session. Despite some quietness in Asia, plenty going on globally, and we should see some significant moves over the next 24 hours. Trade safe, and we'll see you again soon. Bye-bye for now.